The other half, The Autobiography of a Spiv by John Werby offers a gritty and introspective portrayal of a unique character within the context of post-war Britain. Through vivid narrative and a starkly honest tone, Werby presents the life of a spiv, a term referring to a black marketeer or a petty criminal profiteer during the austerity period after World War II. The autobiography delves deep into the psyche of its protagonist, exploring his motivations, challenges, and the moral ambiguities that define his existence. Werby's writing style is unapologetic and raw, reflecting the harsh realities of survival in a socially fractured post-war society. His language is often colloquial, mirroring the streetwise vernacular of the time, which adds authenticity to the narrative. Central to the narrative is the portrayal of the spiv as a figure navigating the gray areas between legality and illegality. Werby paints a complex picture of this character, neither wholly sympathetic nor entirely condemnable. Instead, the autobiography invites readers to empathize with the spiv's struggle for survival amidst economic hardship and social upheaval. Thematically, the other half explores issues of identity and societal marginalization. Werby portrays the spiv as a product of his environment, shaped by the economic depression and the moral ambiguity of the times. The autobiography also sheds light on the human capacity for resilience and adaptation, as the protagonist maneuvers through the challenges and opportunities presented by his circumstances. Moreover, the narrative style of the autobiography contributes significantly to its impact. Werby employs a straightforward yet evocative prose that immerses the reader in the Spiv's world. The use of vivid descriptions and personal reflections deepens the reader's understanding of the protagonist's inner conflicts and external challenges. In conclusion, The Other Half, The Autobiography of a Spiv, by John Werby is a compelling exploration of a marginalized figure in post-war Britain. Through its candid portrayal and vivid narrative style, the autobiography offers readers a glimpse into the complexities of survival, identity, and morality in a turbulent historical period. Werby's ability to humanize his protagonist while not shying away from the darker aspects of his life makes this autobiography a poignant reflection on the human condition.